Hey guys, this is Rush on our tonight three. Welcome back to another part of the Crooked Man. I don't know what actually happened there. Oh well. Uh, so we went back down into the, the basement, and what did we get? Bronze key, which I am not sure where it goes to, but we'll just check it out. We. I don't know. Let's go find Sissy, or something. Let's go check over here. Here? Here? No, that's already unlocked. Here? 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 Wait. Ah, no. Oh! Where does this key go to? Alright, let's see about this place over here. How about you? How about you? How about you? The bar! Cool! Alright, let's see. A journal seemingly written by a staff member. The last page is randomly and sloppily written. A toast to our owner who left his employees and fled into the night. We will drink all the beer we've got. Hell is the only good thing here. Being out of a job's no good, but at least we don't have to see his mug no more. We are we were so sick of that egghead always trying to flaunt his intelligence. Stalling weird stuff for the basement door, having a number lock on the food storage, all his silly crap made the place impossible to run. Plus the Pasco was this thing with a book which he changed up every month. What the hell do you do if you forget? Maybe it's good for him, but sure as hell not us. Oh whatever. Once we're done with the booze, we're out of here. A toast to our bright features. Door to the f food storage is at the far end of the first floor, right? Pass code on food is pretty crazy. I would not want to be there. Is that it? Yeah, it is. Okay. Let's go. But wait, I didn't even know what... Uh... We gotta go back to the room. Wasn't the book of the month, uh, Dr. Jekyll and Mr. Hyde or whatever? Okay. What the? That sound. I wouldn't know, but I'm just gonna go. Ah, here it is. <clears throat> uh. One. Do I have to read all this? Wait, hold on. Where's chapter three? Oh, the passcode is probably the um missing chapters. And uh oh, here it is. Give me. Okay. How to get my mechanical pencil? I'm sorry, guys. Three. What? Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Six. Hold on. Three, six, seven, nine. Six, seven, nine. Is that it? Is that it? Three, six, seven, nine. I think that's it. All right, let's go. Da 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 da. Someone there? Ah, oh, crap. Oh, you've got to be kidding me. No way! That that monster did it really? Fudge! It's coming this way! Crap, I gotta escape! Okay. Why did I not mo Oh, crap. I thought I was moving. Ah, be right back, guys. Back. And I am so gonna save. There. That's what I should have done before. Hi, ugly dude. Oh 
come on! What the heck? I'm trying to move here. It really didn't want me to move to the left. Ah! I hate this game. Ah, fudge. Why couldn't it let me move? Oh, there we go. Aha! If I drop him down here... Finally. Push him into the hole! Okay, so I had to s step back. Okay. What is that monster? So, what I saw earlier... Yeah, you're not... Damn, I can't believe such a thing exists! There's no way it's coming back now. The room under is locked tight. I should warn Sissy when I see her. I knew it would be dangerous for her. I'm gonna save. That would be the best thing to do. Sissy! Where she is. Sissy! Where are you? I guess I'll go to the food storage first. That would be the best thing to do. Here we go. Three, six, seven, nine. There we go. Ah, it's that thing again. Can I take the knife? Small fruit now, but I can use it. Mm. I could use this to get up to that thing. Two twenty. I'm gonna assume that's the room over here, like by the bar. Yeah. I'm gonna assume that, and hopefully I won't get uh, attacked by that thing. There's a piece of sh paper? Badly burnt. Was this a photo? Looks like it was a woman. Hmm, there's something under the pieces. Uh, I don't need her memory anymore. I know she won't come back, so I have to forget everything, good and bad. Ugh, my head hurts. What's going on? Phew, it's settled down. She's sure I'm exhausted. Guess I haven't slept much. So he brings this photo to clear his broken heart, huh? I... I know I couldn't do that. I'll never forget. Not ever. According to Paul, that makes me a p pansy. Sissy. Oh, there you are, David! Hey, just call myself a pansy, and... Paul called me a sissy, so he called me you. Did you find the box? No, I can't find it. There are lots of rooms I can't go in, so it might be in a, one of those. What's wrong, David? You look kind of pale. Oh, no, it's nothing. Oh, yeah, it's nothing. But, sissy, you should really leave soon. Why? You may not believe me, but there's some kind of bizarre monster around. I found it in the basement. I was attacked by it earlier. You'd definitely be in danger, too. So I think you should go. Look, I don't like dark, scary places either. But there's no need to tease me like that. I'm not a kid afraid of the boogeyman, okay? Er, sorry. But I'm not trying to tease you. I'm telling the truth. Hehe. <laughs> don't worry, I'm not mad. So I'd like to believe you, but a monster? Maybe you mistook something in the dark? 
You could be susceptible to seeing things when you wander around in the dark like this. I like to think you're right. All right, if you insist, but be careful, okay? I know. Well, I'll go looking elsewhere. You do that. And I'll do the same for something. Don't you need to sleep? Well, I doubt I would want to sleep in a uh, haunted place. What? What? I hope that's not blood. I hope that's just like red wine. Message in red? Was this here before? No. Leave me alone. Please leave me alone. Come to me. I'm waiting for you. That does not make sense. Sounds pretty inconsistent. Yeah, I totally agree with you there. Who could have written this? Oh, come on! I dropped you down a pit! Crap, I gotta do something? Yeah, ale! This monster doesn't get up. How about some of this? Guess that won't do much alone. What else can I do? Uh, ah! Uh, do it like, uh, what's his name? Uh, like the Jeff the Killer. Let it! Aha! Now that he's covered in alcohol, he should be plenty pl flammable. Yep. Jeff the Killer. I am glad I read to- I am glad I read creepypastas. He ran away. Phew. What the hell is that thing? Why is it chasing me? How did it survive before? Uh, it's not alive. I might need something to defend myself. Now where could I look? Uh, the knife and the frigging fizz storage? That would be plenty of explainable. Or something like that. I don't know. But the freaking storage had the freaking knife that you could have taken whenever you were in there. You idiot. That's not scary at all. Hello. A fruit knife. Maybe I should take it just for self defense. Got a knife. Gonna save it. Alright. What the heck? Blood? This wasn't here earlier. Did did something happen to Sissy? I better look for her. Oh sure, let's go ahead and follow the blood trails. That is kinda of like reminding me of Final Fantasy Seven. Let's lead into this hallway. And leading to this store right here. Whoa! Sissy! Sissy? Sissy, what are you doing here? Your arm's bleeding. So what is your blood? Were you hurt? My arm caught on something. It's not that big of a deal. Don't worry about it. It's bleeding a lot, though. And you've been resting here, right? What if you have anemia? I'm just a little tired. I've been walking around a lot. Really, don't worry about it. Give me your hand, sissy. I have a handkerchief, so I can at least try to wrap it up. That looks like more of a bandage than a handkerchief. I guess this is better than nothing. Doesn't does it hurt? It's fine. Thank you. You're so kind, David. You don't seem so well. Did something happen? Oh, it's nothing. I've just been so silly. Silly? It's silly that I'm wondering this dark place all alone. Falling in holes, cutting my arm. All to find some measly box. Measly? But it's important, right? A memento from your boyfriend? Well, he's my ex, to be exact. Huh? He left me quite a while ago. 
But while we were dating, this hotel was our special place. That was when I lost the box. I've been worried about it ever since, but I only just worked up the courage to look come look. I thought I could forget everything about him, but it was no good. Coming here brought all brought back all these memories. Why did you break up? I don't know. Maybe that's why I won't give up. He said he appreciated my kindness, but when we broke up, uh, broke up, he said it was all I had. He was exactly right, so I couldn't reply. I really am a wimp. Okay, really? First is sissy, then a pansy, now a wimp. This is like syn a lot of, of synonyms, right? I, I don't know. No wonder he'd break up with me. Even I'd hate a girl like me. Sorry, I know I'm just annoying you. I'll rest here a little, uh, a while longer. I'm a little dizzy. This is for your help, David. Oh, I found this. I'm not sure where it goes, though. Keats is somewhere. Thanks. Don't strain yourself, okay? Well, I'm going. You just stay here and try to keep yourself safe for once. Why are you la always like this, David? Like, like what? You're always such a yes man. Just going with the flow. Don't you have a personality? I don't mean to. I mean, I try to think for myself. I don't see it that way. You're not kind. You're just indecisive. It would be the same with anyone but me, right? That's why I can't trust you. Look, please, just listen. I'm always thinking of you. If I'm a pain, then I'm sorry. There you go again. Thinking you can just apologize and everything will be fine. You don't understand a word I'm saying. Then, what should I do? You just don't trust me, is that it? It's hopeless for us. I hate for it to end this way, but it would just be an annoyance for us both to stay together any longer. Thanks for everything, David. Goodbye. Well, wait! We can talk this out! Surely! Kindness is all you have. Sissy and I are the same like that. Timidly refusing to forget. The moment I realized she didn't love me, I felt like I was nothing but worthless. I wonder if Sissy felt that way too. Uh, never mind. I am not going to say anything else because, yeah, I don't know. Ah, whoa! Sparkly. Something's in the fountain. Ah, a box? Maybe this is the one Sissy lost. It must be. It's decorated with rubies. Did someone throw it away here or what? Man, I'm glad I found it. I'll give this to Sissy pronto. Got Sissy's box. Give me a second, guys. Alright, time to go find Sissy. What? Oh, okay. Uh, do, 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 do. Sissy, I got your jewelry box, and there's a lot of blood that I can't even walk through. Huh? Did Sissy leave? But she's wounded. <coughs> Sissy. Oh no, that theme song. That can only mean the crooked man. And he's not Casper the Friendly Ghost either, guys. Where he is? Piano! Sissy! Uh. Uh. No, no! Stay away! Stop right there! Back off, monster! David! Yeah, you hate me, don't you? Damn it. 
Sissy, get out of this. Get out of the hotel. D David, what are you? I said run away. I'll take care of this. Hey, monster. I don't know what the hell you are, but don't you lay a finger on Sissy. Oh, I get to save. Yay. All right, let's go. Oh. Ah, it got stuck. Ow! Ow. Ah, don't get stuck! Don't get stuck, please. Don't get stuck. Ah! Yay! Final Fantasy always works. <laughs> Alright, cool. David. David! <sighs> David, are you okay? Yeah, I don't think it'll chase us anymore. Never mind me, are you okay? I'm fine. I'm not hurt, but... Sissy? What's wrong? Are you sick? Why? Why did this happen? Why did I have to go through this? Why did a monster attack me? I... I just didn't want to forget him. I just wanted to have my memory of him. Is it because I'm such a wimp? Is that why this happened? Can I... Can I not even love him? No, I hate it. Someone! Somebody! Help! Sissy. Um, what's wrong with being a wimp? I'm gonna try this one. What's wrong with being a wimp? Huh? You may feel like a sissy for not being able to forget him, but... Is that such a bad thing? David? I was dumped a few months ago, too. I was sure we were going to get married. You, too? I was dejected. Even now, it still pains me. I don't think I can truly forget it. I've always hated how I was such a coward. I'm a miserable excuse for a man, especially in romance. I couldn't even be happy when my friend got married. And it made me hate myself more and more. But looking at you, I've come to think. Maybe it's not bad to keep thinking of the same person. In fact, maybe it's a wonderful thing. I decided I wouldn't give up either. I just thanks to you, sissy. Thank you. David. This is your treasure, right? It's quite the box. It's a shame. To, it's be a shame to throw it away. Take a gear. Uh, I can't read. I'm sorry, guys. Take good care of it, okay? I'm sure the one you'll love will understand. And I know I'll always support you. Thank you, David. I, I'll try a little harder. I hope things go well for you, too. Hey, David? Did the box come with a key? Ah, cr are you serious? A key? No, I didn't see one. Strange. The box needs a key to open it, so... Though I didn't lock it. A key. Wait, hold on. Maybe this brass key. <laughs> nah, of course not. Ah, yes! That's the one! Where did you find it? R really? Er, I picked it up around here. Key from my house opened Sissy's box, so the former tenants involved with the box? What does that mean? I wonder why it was locked. Let's open it. Oh, there's a piece of paper. That's... Sissy, can I look at that? I thought so, and much as the no notebook pages. Oh, come on! It was wet! It was in the water! How could it still be legible for le 
reading whatever which means he I don't get it but I guess that the guy you're looking for put this paper in here seems that way it has an address on it are you going there David yeah he wasn't here so I'll check there next okay be careful I'll escort you home sissy it's dark out after all I'll be alright think so David well The paper was. Aww! I'm really thankful, David. Let's see each other again sometime. Ah, that cute little blush. That, that surprised me. <laughs> but she seems happier now. That's good. I feel a little more relaxed myself. Lingering sense of dreams. Is that where he is? I'll go check it out. I've come this far. Until I see him, I'll go anywhere. Scene 1. Hotel Ruinheim, Sissy. End. Alright, so if you like this, please leave, uh, if you like this video, please leave a like and comment. And next time we'll be going on an adventure of hotel, of, not hotel, but, uh, very much more creepiness and possibly our impending doom. So take care guys and have a good day. See ya!